Hey guys, Oscar here for Not A Grouch. I'll give you a look into an Asian supermarket. We're at the deli area right now. Getting some chicken wings like this. These are so good. Specifically, this is a Korean restaurant. Korean supermarket called Zion Market. There's some really cool stuff here, so I'll show you around. If you like Asian food, like noodles and meats and stuff like that, find yourself an Asian supermarket near you you'll find all this kind of stuff here and you'll find some interesting things here we have some seaweed of course they have some American stuff too right but the most interesting thing is all the seafood and the meat so I'll show you some of that this is the kind of seafood you'll find so here's some crab shrimp salmon big tiger shrimp squid Sandfish, crab, live crab, abalone, geoduck. I don't know if you remember that episode of Dirty Jobs with Micro. That's what this is. Here they have some sort of flounder fish. Besides that, they have some of the interesting stuff. Let's see if we can find some. Beef knee bone. And over here, let's see what they have. We're looking for this strange stuff. This is all regular stuff, just kind of slides for you. Black pork belly. Oh, hi. That's what I got. <laughs> you got black pork belly? Uh -huh. What is? What, why is it black? I don't know. Okay. We find some weird stuff. Weird stuff. Pork feet. Pork skin. Beef feet. Beef. Beef. Beef, beef. tendon. Beef. beef. Tribe. Beef. Chicken gizzards. That's pretty straightforward. Beef spleens. I don't know why you would want a beef spleen. And then of course you have the normal produce area. The cool thing about the produce area is that you find some stuff that's really expensive at the American supermarkets or cheap. Look at this, 79 cents a pound for ginger. Let's see what else we find that's interesting. All kinds of leaves that you don't find at an American store. Watercress, celery, Find celery at American store. Bok choy. Oh, here's more cactus pear. Cactus fruit, like I showed you in the other video. This is what it looks like. This is like green, red at the same time, but most of the time it's green or red. Seafood mushroom. There's nothing seafoody about it, but it's really good. The only thing that you need to know about Asian supermarkets, especially the produce area, is that you have to learn how to pick your produce. It's not like pristine, nice, like, uh, you know, Ralph's or Gelson's and stuff. You have to actually be able to pick. Hey, you want to pick some fruits? Take a look at the fruits. Here's normal stuff. Yeah. Kiwi, avocado, apples, Asian pear, Fuji apple, little watermelon, Santa Claus melon. What is this? What is Santa Claus melon? Oh, that's funny. In Spanish, it's called frog skin. That's weird. Grapes, regular stuff, you know. Persimmons, or persimmons, I don't know how you say it. And then you find little girls, pomegranate, papaya, more apples. And of course, something that's interesting about Asian supermarkets is that they always have other stores within the store. Like over there you see a florist, over there you see like a accessories and clothing store. On the other side there's a bakery which is pretty standard. So pretty cool stuff. Those are some big Mexican squash. Oh yeah, another thing you find here is mushrooms of all kinds. They have oyster mushrooms, shiitake mushrooms, let's see what else over here. Crimini mushrooms. Big shiitake mushrooms again. Lots of greens, lots of leaves, lots of herbs. Basil, spelled funny. 
okra, Thai chili. I have no idea what this is. I have no idea what this is. Sounds like a sounds like an herb out of uh, Harry Potter's. Habanero peppers. Look at that. That's a lot of habanero peppers for two fifteen. Long bean. Let's go. Oh, we have a little bit another strange meat section. Let's go look. Oh, and if you want garlic, this is where you get garlic. Look at that. Peeled, ready to go, no mess. A little tiny mushroom that you see in the soups. Turmeric, look at that. $3 for all that. If you buy a little tiny box of a few ounces at the American store, you'll pay six, seven dollars for it. A banana flower, that's interesting. Aloe vera, if you want for your sunburn. Let's see what they have over here. Anything interesting? The chicken wings. What's this? Oh, spare ribs. Yeah, that's bacon. Look at that pork belly. And then there's this fruit that somebody gave me at the pool one time. So good. I'll show you later in another video. Logan Dragon Eye. That's this. I don't know what that is. I know the normal stuff like blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, strawberries, all kinds of berries. Mini Roma tomatoes, big boxes of kiwi, mangoes, papayas, more mangoes, and grapes, lots of grapes. Look at these tiny little grapes. They even have all the Asian accessories here like, you know, plates and spoons and special serving dishes. And then they have these things. This are used to dry your clothes. That's pretty funny find everything in these stores and of course a frozen section where you'll find even more strange seafood stuff let's see like this where do you have octopus what's this here clam meat squid carved next to the Mexican coca-cola what is this wet foot octopus what how about a little ribbon of fish? This is called yellow croaker. They have a lot of dry stuff. A lot of dry shrimp. This is where you find all kinds of noodles too. Look at this. Noodles, 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 noodles. More frozen stuff here. Mostly noodles and you know, dumplings hot stickers kind of thing. Shepherd purse? I don't know what that is. Crab meat or imitation crab meat. All kinds of sugary drinks. All kinds of rice and grains. Lots of sauces and oils and vinegars. And then there's of course all the funny like candy that's jelly candy the kids love. Right here, this is Claire's favorite section. That's it for the Korean supermarket tour. Pretty interesting stuff you find here. Put your open mind hat on and leave your sensibilities at the door and you'll have a great time. See you next time. Bye.